Good morning, Keller Williams, and welcome back to the KW Command 66 Day Challenge Teams mini series. And today is day seven. Uh, today, I wanted to talk to you about two brand new lead routes that have been created as part of the new team enhancement and team rollout. So, in order to get to our lead routes, we need to be under the Rainmaker account. So, I am the Rainmaker for my team. Um, or excuse me, we need to be signed in as the Rainmaker and then be under the team account. So I am signed in as the Rainmaker, I'm in my team account, and then I can come into the settings menu. And then here on the left hand side underneath command settings, we're going to see lead routing. And I can click on that and then choose routes. From there, I can create a new route. And underneath routing rules, there used to be three here. It was randed, weighted, random, and jump ball. We have two new lead routes here, round robin, which will show you it sends leads to an agent in an ordered list. If the agent does not claim the lead in a lot of time, it will send it to the next agent in the list automatically. So on the next page, we can actually set up the agents that get involved in this round robin. But essentially, if I had three agents, it would go to agent one and then agent two and then agent three, right? If agent one claims it right off the bat, then the next lead would go to agent two. If they claim it off the bat, then the next lead would go to agent three. If any of those agents don't claim it in the times that I have prescribed down here at the bottom, then it continues to go to that next agent, right? So assigned to agent, this is really good for a lead source that Maybe you have multiple people on your team and yet this one lead source automatically goes to a specific agent. So you can see this route will assign all leads from the lead source you selected to one agent. It'll override any other routes that contain the same source and date time designation. Uh, the team that I used to be a part of before becoming a PC coach in RTT now, uh, we used to have what we called kingdoms. So each person on the team had a specific lead source that was their kingdom. They were the only ones working it. It was their job to really perform and convert at a high level. Um, that would be perfect for assigned to agent. So those are the two new lead routes here. You can see if I do choose round robin, uh, let's just put in a name so I can go to the next page. Uh, I can just say this is an all time route and I'll give uh, the agents three minutes to claim the lead. If I go to next, then you can see I can search for the lead source. Let's just say I wanted to do uh, Facebook ads as an actual um, Facebook ad leads, right? So I wanna do these leads coming in as round robin. I could choose Facebook ad lead. And then you can see, and here's the other thing too, I've, I've noticed that if you click on it, you still have this drop down showing up and it looks like you haven't actually chosen it. If you click off, this is where you'll see that lead source, just a heads up there. And then if I go to next, I can say, okay, I want to assign which agents to this round robin, right? And so then I could just come in and pick the people that I wanted to be involved in the round robin there. So that's how you would set up round robin. Uh, the assigned to agent, pretty obvious. You would just pick the one agent that it's being assigned to, and then you can move forward from there. So those are the two new lead routes that came out as part of the team rollout. Hopefully you'll find use in one or both of those for your teams. And uh, we'll talk a little bit more about uh, lead routing later on in the challenge as well when we get into reports. Hope everyone's having a fantastic day. And as always, I'll look forward to speaking with you again real soon.